Hello people, so now that we've got this bad boy unboxed, let's have a little look at this treasure trove of technology. So we've got the motion controller here, which has the infrared sensors dotted around the controller, which gives you the one-to-one -one tracking we've all been waiting for. Uh, we've got an adjustable lanyard here as well, um, looks like some menu buttons there. Nice little trigger button for the pew pews and nice smooth trackpad. Got that satisfying click there as well. And we've got some grip pads either side of the motion controller as well. So when you're picking stuff up and bashing your controller into the side of things as well. That looks pretty nifty. And then we've got the lighthouse base stations as well, which We've got infrared LEDs inside and we've got little motors in this bin. You just sweep the room and you pick up on these sensors and the controllers and the headset. We've got a power cable, a sync button by the looks of it. And just looking at that one, just from the picture, it looks like it's a sync cable and that's a USB port, which I imagine you can update the uh, firmware for it. We've got a few mountain screw brackets bits there for when you're putting them up. Uh, I don't know what that is, <laughs> no idea. I'll have a look at that later. Uh, this just looks like it's all cables corresponding to the stuff that we've got. So USB cables charger for the controllers. Another one in there as well. And I imagine there'll be stuff for the base stations in here. So we've got the well, it's a 3.5 mil jack by the looks of it, so it'll be the same as the sync cable jack. So it must be the sync cable. And we've got some instructions there. Base station mountain guide. I've mounted a few brackets in my time, so I probably won't need that. And we've got some power cables and power adapters all in there as well. And we have... Nice little blue box, a little bit of a raised pattern design on it, nice and shiny. And this is the link box, so we've got all the, all the ports there, which will all correspond, HDMI's, powers, and stuff like that. And I believe that's just all the cables inside as well for the link box. And this is the headset there. So you've got the chaperone camera at the front there, which uh, stops you bashing into things. And also you can just use that camera, you press a button, I believe on the controller, and you can just use that camera as a normal camera. So you can pick up your phone or grab something that you need. And we've got more uh, infrared sensors on the front there, dotted around. It looks like some sort of adjustable button, maybe for the distances, uh, for the lenses. I'll take a quick look. That is what it looks like inside it as well. And you've got the nice foam cushion. You've got a HDMI cable, power cable, and USB. And it's also got adjustable velcro straps there for your head. So it does different head sizes. So yeah, it all looks pretty cool, all pretty sweet. Can't wait to get started with it. Now we're going to do the setup. Um, I might do a video on the, the doing the setup as well. Um, just let us know in the comments below if you do want a setup video. If not, I'll just get straight into the game. Thank you.